Hello Capricorn and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Yeah, this person, um, they know it's taken them too long to come forward, okay? They're praying, they're laying here praying. Um, I'm, I'm just getting the sense that somebody's laying here with headphones on listening to a love, like a lot of love songs. Okay, I don't know what that's all about, guys. I'm just, I'm hearing like one song after another, you know. Um, yeah, it's because you're moving on. It's because you're moving forward. You're closing out a cycle. You don't, you know, you're feeling good. You're confident. Um, you're, you've healed. You're, uh, you're in the public eye. Maybe this person has been watching you. Okay, you could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius, Taurus, Aries. Um, uh, this just fell off the bottom of the deck here. Cl uh, clarify this Queen of Swords. I, I, this person could have a choice to make between two people, okay? This could be the, that one of these people, the Queen of Swords. Very, I feel like she's bitter, okay? <laughs> I get this bitter feeling off of this person and you're in this loving peaceful nurturing um empath kind of energy right star energy here um yeah this person has a decision to make and i feel like they're about ready to drop the truth bomb okay um they're getting ready to speak their truth they're going to pick up this last sword they know it's a third party it's caused a lot of heartache and betrayal. This person's heartbroken. And they're about to, um, I feel, speak the truth to this Queen of Swords. I feel like they they want this, ooh, they want this star energy. Guys, the cards are just flying all over the place. Yeah, they don't, that wanted to come out in reverse. They don't want to work on this anymore. Yeah, these fell on the floor also. We've got the... Ace of Cups. Yeah, this person wants something new. There they are, late at night, listening to a list of a playlist of love songs over and over and over again. Um, what in the world, man? Okay, so what's going on with this person? I feel like they're gonna tell this Queen of Swords, you know what, they don't want to work on this anymore. They could after after six, maybe seven years of being with this Queen of Swords energy, they don't want to be there anymore. They want their star back, the one who's moving on. This is their central focus is you, collective. You know, and here I feel like you're not speaking to this person. You may have them blocked. They see this coming to an end. Yeah. Um... Baby, come back. That's one of the songs that I'm hearing. Oh, who did the baby come back? Any kind of fool could see there was something in everything about you. Bum, bum, bum. Baby, come back. Who did who did that song? Is that the Bay City Rollers or? Oh, I don't know who I don't know who does that song, guys. Yeah, you can blame it all on me. I was wrong, and I just can't live without you. Yeah, they're realizing, man, they want back in. They've got a whole playlist of love songs, okay? Um, I'm here in Hinder. Um, a thing for you got a thing for you. Yeah, as as I say that, the Ace of Wands comes out. <laughs> I got a thing for you. Here's the thing. This is why they're all upset. You're getting new love here. They're finding out about it somehow. They're watching you. They see how sexy you are out here. I feel like you're about to get a hot, passionate new love. Yeah, and this person does not want to let you go. Yeah, they're finding out through other people. They're asking other people um, what's going on with you. They could be watching you online. You could have a public platform here. 
as well, or you could be posting things on the internet, right? Yeah, this person was immature. They lied to you. They had in and out energy. They deceived you. They backstabbed and betrayed you, watched you walk away crying, and did nothing about it. Okay, they were immature. They weren't serious about anything. And now, now they realize, bing, right? Light bulb goes on in their head. They don't want to be without you. I was wrong, and I just can't live without you. Yeah, that's what he says. Um, I don't know who does that song, guys. I'm sorry. Yeah, look at, they're in a lot of pain here. Everything they did to you, all of these swords here that they gave you, the lies, the deceit, the betrayal, it's all come back on this person. And now they're up late at night listening to a playlist of love songs, okay? Feeling bad, sitting, laying in bed, sitting in bed, crying, can't sleep at night. They're reviewing everything, that all the lies that they said to you, um, the in and out energy, all that they lost here. You're the one that they want to be with. And here you may be getting new love. Man, they would do anything to turn this around. They would do anything to change this. Magician energy. Yeah, I'm hearing something about it. If I could turn back time, right? If I could find a way, right? Yeah, I take back all the things that uh, have hurt you, um, and you'd stay, yeah, something like that, right? Yeah, because you're moving on. Oh, man. Oodles of love songs. I can't, I can't, I can't, um... It's just that they're playing, they're, they're playing so fast in my head. Yeah, that's what they're doing. They're realizing they're in love with you. They're just realizing they're in love with you and they can't go on without you. That's what this is. Yeah. They're realizing they're in love with you and they can't live without you. That's what, sorry about that. Yeah. And now they want to apologize. That card was coming out right when the camera died, okay? <laughs> um, you could be dealing with the Pisces, a uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. They, uh, they think that you're getting new love. You may have um, a new love already. You may have just started something new with somebody absolutely wonderful. It could be getting hot and heavy, Collective. I kid you not. Um, and they could be finding this out from, from a friend or somebody or social media. Yeah, man, they're feeling like a fool. This person's in love with you. They've been hiding how they feel, but they can't. I don't think they can keep it in anymore. <laughs> They're kind of a mess. Yeah, they're they're seeing that you may have other options here, collective, and they're feeling like a fool because they let you go. And they want you back. Baby, come back. Yeah. I was wrong, and I just can't live without you. Yep. Yeah, I feel like whoever they're with, they got in a toxic situation um, here with uh, of this Queen of Swords, okay? They could be dealing with an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, maybe a Capricorn. Um, but yeah, they're realizing here that it's toxic. They don't want to put any more work into that. They want you back. That's it. They're up all night crying over you, wanting to apologize. Feeling like a fool, hearing that you've got new passionate love, or you will soon. And they have an extensive love song playlist. Okay, is this your person? Right? Right? Watching you, or maybe this Queen of Swords is watching them and you. 
Um, clarify this page of swords. Yeah, I feel like they're watching you and they're burdened. I feel like, you know, yeah, they, they hate going home. They may be getting watched like hounded by this page of swords. Like they don't, uh, she doesn't leave them alone. This person can barely even go to the bathroom by themselves. Okay. Um, she does not, she doesn't want this person out of her sight because she realizes she's got intuition, man. This is a very intuitive person here. Very smart. And she knows that your person hates being where they are. They go home every day like this, hating even walking through the door, okay? As they approach the house, they get a sick feeling in their gut because they know they're going to be faced with this Page of Swords energy, uh, this toxic partner. They don't want to be there anymore. So they trap themselves in their room at night by themselves. I don't see them um, even sharing a bed with this Queen of Swords anymore. And they listen to a love song playlist and fall apart, okay? Thinking about you. Thinking about you sharing passion with somebody new. When they want to get back together. Yeah, that's all that they think about is you. And I feel like they want to get back together, man. That's, you know. And what they lost here. This is what they lost. Unconditional love. From somebody that they could have trusted that didn't have any bad intentions for them. A blessing. This is what they missed out on. Yeah, baby, come back. Who does that song? I don't even know where my phone is right now. Um, I got to look that up. Drop a comment if you guys know who does that song. Because that's what they want here. They, that's the one of the songs on their playlist anyway. Okay? That's one of them. Yeah. I really get the sense that, you know, this is them. Look, they pushed you away before. Okay? They pushed this connection away. They pushed you away. Um, and now this person wants to take action. I mean, it's the simplest form, okay? They pushed you away, and now they, they, they just want to see you again. They want to talk to you again. They want to tell you how they feel. Um, they're an emotional mess, all right? But they're, they're kind of doing it to themselves because they're playing that, the, all those love songs, right? Um, But man, I feel like they've got some competition here. There's a new person that I, that's either coming into the picture or you've already met somebody new. They're hearing a lot of gossip about you, okay? This person could have been a player too. You know, this is a player card, having a lot of people on the side. Um... Yeah, see, you're about to be in a commitment here. You're about to be in, uh, in a commitment with somebody new. I feel like they're finding out about this. They're finding out that you're about to start or are starting a new, very passionate, hot and heavy romance with somebody new, and it's going to turn in to a commitment, okay? Yeah, they're finding this out. Everything's being exposed here, collective. They're finding this out from somewhere. It's either your social media or gossip or them talking to friends. I think it's all three. It's a combination of all three. This person feels heartbroken. They're a heartbroken mess, okay? They're a heartbroken, crying, blubbering mess right now. It's the love songs, dude. Stop listening to the sad love songs, you know? <laughs> yeah, they're a mess. Look, on the bottom of the deck, feeling guilty, longing for you, and overwhelmed with sadness, okay? I'm telling you, you're in this empress energy. 
Um, you are literally one pentacle away from being in, in a commitment with someone else. You're the treasure out here. They lost big time, and you're the only one that they they can think about. And this is this is making them a mess. Look, they're feeling desperate, knowing that they hurt you. They're sad. They're watching you. They're feeling discouraged and powerless, especially if you get somebody new. I'm telling you, that's what this is. Desperate, sad. Longing for you, guilty. You know, maybe if they listen to something more upbeat, you know, turn on your disco playlist, guy. Yeah, look, because, I, you know, they're just heartbroken. This is them curled up in a little ball <laughs> in the fetal position somewhere just crying. This person's doing a lot of crying. Okay. Yeah, it's the playlist. If they if they got a disco ball and they got a disco playlist, maybe maybe it wouldn't they wouldn't be like this. This is at nighttime too, I feel like right now currently at night this is what's going on. Um yeah, they don't want you to be with anybody else. Yeah, it, very regretful. Irritated by everyone around them and everything that they're hearing about you. That's what's irritating this person, is what they're hearing and seeing. The information is irritating this person, okay? Because they don't want you with anybody else. Um, but I see you about to get new love if you haven't already met them. You know, you've got the Ace of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles coming towards you. Yeah, this person wishes you would just trust them. If they could, if there was any way they could turn back time and, and do things over again, they would. They just want your trust again. See, you used to trust them. You used to look up to this person. Six of Cups is out here. Um, you looked up to them. You respected them. You didn't think they were going to hurt you. You had unconditional love for them, and they broke your trust. And now they're wishing that, that they're, yeah, praying. They're praying they can get you to trust them again. Or they're wishing you would trust them again. I feel like they're praying you don't get with somebody new and they can have a second chance here. But right now, all that, look at, and they're crying. See, there's those un, more tears here. This person's doing a lot of crying. And I feel like, you know, they're really not taking any action, though. Look at this. Look at all of this emotion. Waves of emotion crashing over this person. And you're moving on. They're just kind of standing here going, don't go, right? Don't look at, don't read the words. Just look at the picture. That's how I do it. Just look at the picture, okay? You've taken your training wheels off, collective. That means you've learned how to ride that bike. That means you've learned your lessons. And now you're ready to move forward much quicker. Not having anything slowing you down. Detaching from this connection. Leaving your person behind in a panic, right? They're watching you move forward. And man, that emotion. Water in tarot stands for emotions. Look at there's an ocean of emotion this person is is like trying to um tread water through I mean it, it's it, it's crying here crying here crying here crying here sad okay overwhelmed with all of this emotion okay desperate here's more crying here this is this is a lot of emotion more tears here. This All this person is doing is crying. They just lay in bed at night and cry. And you're moving on. They're finding out you're, you've got new love coming towards you. Um, and they can't, they can't bear it. Baby, come back. Baby, come back. You can blame it all on me I was wrong 
and I just can't live without you. Yeah. Oh, anyway, collective, listen, that's what I've got for this reading. I got to clear this energy because it is, they really need to change their playlist, I got to say. Um, they're torturing themselves really is what they're doing. Okay. 